I know you, you hate religion. Well, I, I, you know, hate is a really tough word because you have to actively live hate. And I don't hate right. anything, but I have a strong distaste. The uh, way we've given over ourselves to this um, invisible man in the sky right. who has a list of things he doesn't want us to do. Uh, I mean, it's an absurdity. It's primitive. Right. It's, it's on a par with, uh, with worshiping rocks and, and the sun. And so it's it just it's absolutely a primitive it's just so many people that die and kill in the name of well, religion. Well, what about the modern religious people who say, ah, but we can still say that God is science, that kind of whole argument thing, you know? Well, th there are people who say, well, there's, a, there's, a, there's an organizing intelligence maybe in the universe, some sort of an organizing intelligence. Now, I used to call myself an atheist until I found, I realized, found out or realized one or the other, uh, that that's kind of a belief too. And I don't really like to be stuck with a belief. So in, in, in the official uh, listing of the titles, I would probably fall under agnostic right. because I have no way of knowing the answer to any of these things. But I'm sure it's not a judgmental <laughs> male figure yeah. who throws lightning bolts and puts <laughs> you in a place of fire so it's not and Zeus. punishes you and That's... keeps track of kids who are nine years old, whether they're touching themselves or not. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's just an absurdity on its face. That's Santa Claus, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Santa does the touching, I see. Okay.